I still remember the first day I walked through the doors, I was very cranky because I didn't want to leave my last church. And my mum had said to me, you are going to love the music. And from the first day that I walked in the doors, I was captivated by the music and I've been captivated ever since. Week by week, just coming together as a church family is fantastic. Our, our Sunday services are a highlight for me. I really enjoy those. But I think just the, the dynamic of family within our church, um, whether it, you're coming along and the youth, the things that are going on, uh, whether it's our things going on during the week that minister to people, I think just the whole family dynamic of our church, I think, is a real highlight. You know, Jesus said to uh, his disciples, you know, the world's going to know you. You have to have love one for the other, and that's how the world's going to know you, that, uh, that they recognize your love for one another. And I think that is operating in our church, and I see it. If, you, if you're not at the right place, God will move you on. And you know you're at the right place when people uh, have love both ways. You love them and, you, and they love you. The first thing that drew me to the church was actually my parents started coming. Um, obviously I was probably about eight years old, just from memory, um, but loved it. I think for me a highlight of our church is really like the praise and worship and like I knew a lot about God before I came to this church but I feel like this is the place where I really learned to know God and to worship Him and to have a really personal relationship with Him. just felt like family oriented church. Everyone was so friendly around here and mm, that's what really drew us to this church.
guess it's just been a, a very stable point of our lives in that regards. So it's brought a, a lot of stability to our lives, just the family, sense of family, sense of community. Uh, when things go wrong in our lives all the way around, and you know that you've got a, a safe place, a stable place, and uh, that's because of the Spirit of God and the people that are here. I wouldn't say that was the biggest highlight for me. It was more just being given opportunities by like uh, our awesome pastors and just encouragement, like all through our walk with Christ, encouraged to go the next step and just continue to grow and walk in God. It's been awesome. Great is your love. Great is your I think we're multi-generational. I think we have things for all generations, the older, the youth and the younger ones and I think that really helps keep a church healthy. We, uh, we first arrived uh, at the church coming from Newcastle and the first thing I remember seeing on the walls of the church was the big sign community and below that church and um, for our transition we had to travel backwards from Newcastle to Shell Harbour over about a three or four month period and as we were traveling um, I just felt more and more that our church's DNA uh, was was to be typified by a, a real heart to serve and to reach our community. God's really got a heart for the poor and the downtrodden so as we arrived, we really felt that Shell Harbour Community Church was to be that, uh, a church with a heart for the community, uh, not just a church to serve its own needs, uh, but to be a congregation that was focused on reaching out to our community. Great is your love, great is your love, great is your love. Church and praise and worship. The big highlight for me was um, like the youth camps that we went on. I went to like three or four and they were like really cool. Watching all of the younger people just sort of give their life to Jesus was pretty cool. And just building new connections and stronger connections with all of the youth kids. Great is your love, great is your love, great is your love. Great is your love, great is your love, great is your love. Great is your love, great is your love.
I think the reason why this church has stood the test of time is that we've remembered why we're here, um, that our foundation's on God and that it's not about what we get out of church, it's what we can give to others. And I've seen that develop and grow over the years, that different people have come and gone, but the reason why the church keeps enduring is because we're there to serve our community, to serve others and to make a difference in people's lives. And that conviction in God carries you through every storm every challenge and it makes all of the hard years worth it because for me even though um, you go through ups and downs this has always been home.